Uh, poor Enzo. He'll be fine. Don't worry about him. We actually have a mini boss down here, so I'm gonna correct the uh, collect. Uh, collect. I'm not Japanese. I'm sorry. That that was disgustingly racist. Anyway, I'm gonna collect those rings and jump down here. Red. Damn it, who did that? I just bought the damn thing. Haven't you figured it out yet? There's no quarter for you in this world. It's, uh, it's so easy to love Bayonetta. And finished. Crap. I should have saw that coming. Whoa, what was that? That was like a strong kick. Whatever, never mind. Anyway, I should probably talk about this song. I didn't notice it at first. Get out of here, you're not hitting me. I should probably mention this. I didn't know this when I first played this game. Oh, I didn't even notice that. Shoot. I didn't notice it at first, but this is actually like a remix of a famous song that... Well, uh, he didn't make it, but a song that Frank Sinatra actually sang back in the day. And I looked it up. I found that out because I was actually looking for this song. Cause it, I was at this tutorial part for so long, just playing with the controls. That bullet time. Oh, I forgot, that's the mini boss over there. There we go. Nope. Alright, I'm gonna hurry up and take out this guy. I'm done, I'm done with this mission. Just about. I'm probably gonna make this just like uh, one mission per part. So this is going to be it for this guy right here. And wouldn't you know, we kept it stylish. Gold rank. Oh, Radon should be paying me for even touching these toys. You have any idea how much this is gonna cost to fix? How the fuck do I always get wrapped up in this shit? Hmm. Engine still purrs nicely. Now, about this little thing you've been looking into for me, Enzo. Let's have a quick chat. See? This is why I told you I was going home. I just got held up in the air by some invisible things, and you want an intelligence briefing? It never stops with you! I can't help but feel bad for Enzo like sometimes. That, and you're liable to wake Eggman from the dead. And I don't think either of you would like that. Uh. Catch you later, Bayonetta. Something tells me you're gonna need a rush on our special project before this shit hits the fan. Wait, Rodan. What about Eggman? Such a popular chap. I bet they hate him down there as much as you did when he was up here. We just need to make sure he won't come crawling back when they kick him out. Nothing a flower bed can't fix. Fill her up. Poor guy. You heard the man. Finish up in five minutes, or you're walking home to your cake and candles. What? Don't you leave me here! Oh, poor Enzo. I still don't know if that uh, Eggman reference is a reference to the Sonic series, but regardless, that was a good first mission, and I'm glad we were able to get through that. But, like I said, I kind of want to keep this... Oh, I didn't even know you could spin around in midair. She's really trying to put Dante to shame because that's something he can't do in the Double Make Right game. But again, I kind of want to keep these like one mission per part just to elongate what's probably already a long game. So, uh, crap. Plus the copyright strike. So these are going to have to be split into two different parts. Eh, that should be fine. So let's wait for it to finish. And I'm going to have to stop it right there. Again, end of the video. So if you enjoyed this part, if you enjoyed the stylish show that we just got to see, would you call that showmanship or showwomanship? I don't know. Anyway, if you enjoyed this video, if you enjoyed my gameplay, which I really got to work on, and the gloriousness that is Bayonetta herself, then please leave a like, please leave a comment, share it to anybody that you think might be interested in this kind of thing, and I'll see you guys in the next part. Thank you.